These questions are taken from the 2020 Department of Education booklet. Usually we find these maps attached to our exam papers under the heading of annexures. What's important about this map is that it has a scale right at the bottom and we will be using the scale and the map to answer these questions. Use the given scale to calculate the actual distance between the purification plant and the old pond. We need to learn how to read the scale and how to apply it. We take our ruler and we measure the line of that scale. So from 0 to 5 we measure the line using our rulers and we get an amount. What that tells us is that the size of that line will be equal to 5 kilometers. Our ruler measurement will equal to the kilometers shown on that scale. So we've measured the line of the scale and we have 3.5 centimeters. Now this 3.5 centimeters which I've measured is on a actual page size according to your exam paper. So it would be difficult to show you on the video as to the proper measurement. But should you look at this question and you will find that it is 3.5 centimeters. The 3.5 centimeters is your distance on the map and the 5 kilometers is your distance on the ground. So its distance of, on the map is equal to distance on the ground. The scale we would be working with is 3.5 centimeters is to 5 kilometers. Now this is how you write scale is the distance on the map is to the distance on the ground. For this particular question, we are able to work with this scale. The question asks us to find the actual distance between the purification plant and the old pond. Actual distance means the distance on the ground. The purification plant is the dot on the top. The old pond is at the bottom, the dot as well. Currently, we know that we have the scale and then we know that we need to work out the actual distance which is on the ground and we call this x because this is what we will be working out. How do we get the measurement for the distance on the map? On the map, they've told us about two places. So what we need to do is take our ruler and measure the distance between those two places, the purification plant and the old pond. Measuring the distance on the map as indicated by the green line, we arrive at six centimeters. Now we indicate our six centimeter on the side where it states distance on the map. We have two units of measure, the centimeter and the kilometer, and I put them in their respective columns. Keep in mind that our final answer will be in kilometers. Cross multiply, we get x times 3,5 and 6 times 5. Multiplying through, we get 3,5x is equal to 30. Divide both sides by 3,5. We arrive at 8,57 kilometers. Determine the scale if the distance from Port Edward to the nature reserve is 65 kilometers. In determining a scale, we must always have the format of 1 is 2 and whatever the amount is. And the second thing is that our units must all be the same. So the first thing we will do is measure on the map the distance between Port Edward and the nature reserve. This measurement is 4 centimeters in our booklets. So now we write this information down as a scale. So it is 4 centimeters on the map is equal to 65 kilometers on the ground. 65 kilometers is taken from the information given in the question. The next step is to convert both sides to centimeters. And this brings us to 4 is to 6,500,000. Lastly, we need to leave our scale in the format of 1 is 2. So in order for us to get this, we divide both sides by 4. In dividing both sides by 4, we get 1 is 2, 1,625,000. Now remember, this is in centimeters.